Hey, what up? It's your boy, Flex Caliber. What up, Flex Squad? We hit 10,000 views, y'all. I am so thankful and so humbled that me being me in my purest form, no gimmicks, would be enough to make people want to click on these videos 10,000 times. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. I also got a question, which is the perfect segue into what I want to tell you guys. First and foremost, I want to do a giveaway for you guys for hitting 10,000 views. And basically, I don't know what I want to do. So I want you guys to leave in the comments what you guys think would be a dope giveaway for a contest for hitting 10,000 views. Thank you guys. Now, I got a question and it was why I it said I love your channel or whatever, but why are you always in the car? And that is the perfect segue into me telling you guys, hey, we made 10,000 views. Let me tell you guys the history of Flex Caliber in this channel and how I even got here in front of you right now. And Basically, um, so for my whole life, you know, pretty much since like high school, whatever, I've always enjoyed music a lot. I've created music. I was a rapper. I did some things in the rap world or whatever, and I've always been into music or whatever. So, when I would listen to music, I would always react the way I react, you know? And people would always fucking just die laughing. People would love it. No matter where I was, if it was in the Starbucks, at the gym, it didn't matter. I would always have my headphones and I'd put it on and I would just enjoy myself. Um, and just not worry about the people around me. Long story short, people begin to film me. I would get filmed all the time, everywhere, at the gym all the time, all this stuff. And uh, so I, I remember my first EDM song. No, it's not the first EDM song, but I'll say the first trap song that I heard was Flostradamus Original Dawn. And I remember hearing that and saying, holy shit, what is this? And I was like, this is different than, you know, rap trap. I was like, this is some old different shit. Then I went to my first show. And I just fell in love with the EDM culture, the plur lifestyle, just the vibe. My energy connects with that vibe. You know what I mean? So... I, I, I fell in love and I started going to more shows, you know, all San Diego, LA, OC, this whole area. And people, when I would go out with my homies, people would always be like, dude, you should come out with us and da -da -da -da, we're going to this show, come out with us next week and whatever, whatever, whatever. And I was like, all right, that's cool, whatever. But then it got to the point where literally people would be like, we're getting you a ticket and people started buying me tickets to shows and festivals and giving me free tickets just so I could go with them and turn up. And I was like, and I was like, damn, that's, that's, you know, I, I was like, damn, cool. Hell yeah. I was happy about it. I was like, hell yeah. I'm gonna go to a show for free or a festival for free. Fuck yeah. But people will want me to go to turn up with them. And that is basically what the original flex squad was and that is the original flex squad it was just like people different people that were wanting groups of people who would want me to go out and party with them so they would pay for me and my boys to come and party with them and it was the craziest shit you know so that kept happening and um there was one point though this girl who you know was my friend and this is one thing that was pivotal. It stuck in my head. She said to me, I wish you could see how you look to everyone else. And I never thought about that. 
and she, you know, it just made sense. I was like, wow, it made me think like, wow, I, I wish I could see what I look like to everyone else too. Yeah, that's true. Like, and, uh, so fast forward to what, two and a half months ago, I leave the gym and I get in my car and I pull up Spotify and I'm looking for a song to ride out to. And I saw that Ricky Sand had dropped a song that day. If you look back, that was my first video. Um, and I said, to, I just said to myself, you know what? I want to see what she meant by you should see what other people say, see when they look at you when you're turning up and reacting. So I was like, all right, let me put on the camera. I just decided right then and there, I'm going to do this. I didn't think about it prior any time. I was just like, yeah, fuck it. Let me see what I look like to other people. And I did the reaction, and I watched it back, and I loved it. And I was like, oh, shit, now I see what she was talking about. I get it now. And now I see why people, like, fucking basically pay me to go party with them. And uh, so... That happened, and then you guys loved it. I mean, fuck, ever since then, I mean, people have fucked with it. And so that brought me to about a month ago. Now, to answer the question, which was, why do I always do it in my car? I'd say about a month into it, I was talking to one of my homeboys, and I was asking him, like, how I could improve the channel, and I was saying, you know, I want to do different locations and stuff like that, and he was like, nah, bro, you're the dude who does the reactions in a car, like, that's your thing, like, don't switch it up, it's working, and that's what you're known for, like, let people rock with that, if that's what people like to see. And at first, I, I was a little, I was like, yeah, but I want to, but I was like, you know what, that actually makes sense, like, so whatever. And so that's why I always do it in the car, um, because, you know, that's just how it started. I didn't, before that day, I never even planned on doing these reactions. So that's basically the history of this channel and how I started doing this. And it worked out because we hit 10,000 views, y'all. Oh! Thank you guys so fucking much. It means so much to me that you guys keep rocking with me. So, thank you. Once again, I'm going to do a con a giveaway. So, leave in this in this bio, or I mean in the comments, leave some recommendations of some dope prizes that y'all think would be dope and you know your boy Flex, I got you. So, Thank you, everybody. 10,000 views, and that's just the beginning, y'all. It's on and popping. It's your boy, Flex Caliber. Shout out to the whole Flex Squad. I'm out.